hard and brutally expensive. If you want to take a course, you have to adjust to the pace of the program. Lectures can be boring from some of the profs out there, let's face it, and the standards can really vary. On top of that, you might have to relocate to get what you really need. And those textbooks, they can be as expensive as the printing press they once came from. Technology is changing all of this though. Apple in particular has done some amazing things in this field. Did you know that all this learning is available now on your iOS device for free? Sit down and listen class. I'm about to educate you in the future of education. iTunes U has been around for years in our iTunes sidebar, but now it's finally available as an app. When you open the app, you'll see an empty bookshelf. Just tap the catalog button in the top right to jump into the iTunes U catalog and you're set. This is the world's largest online library of free education content with over half a million lectures, videos, books, class assignments, presentations, and more. You can take courses at your own pace in your own time. This breaks a lot of financial and geographical barriers in the education system. It's truly amazing that all this information is available for free. For free. This isn't community college level stuff either. You're getting material from top tier universities like Stanford, Yale, MIT, and Oxford. You can choose a course and click on the subscribe tab to get free updates as you complete each part of the course or download components all at once. You'll also see a post button with assignments in chronological checklist format. Simply complete the assignment and check it off the list. If you press the browse button below, you'll also see a list of colleges and universities to choose from. But iTunes U isn't just for post-secondary, as there's a K-12 through section for elementary and high school students in need of the iTunes U magic. Everyone learns in their own way, and iTunes U is great for a lot of us, like me, who prefer video, audio, or interactive media. I know that the chicken scratches I wrote during lectures weren't exactly legible. There are still some bugs to be worked out, as we found downloading in the iTunes interface to be more reliable. And unfortunately, you can't get an Oxford degree just from taking the iTunes courses, but you do have all of that knowledge right there at your fingertips. Also, you might want to look at doing some of this reading on an iPad as some of the books aren't iPhone compatible. But I'm sure an iPad is still cheaper than all those backbreaking textbooks. And did I mention how amazing that is? It's higher learning, it's free, and for a lot of us who aren't in school anymore, we're probably thinking the same thing. Where were you years ago when I needed you, iTunes you?